Because I think when you go out, you just talk to many people as possible. It's kind of an important historical thing to do, isn't it? Because it's a big part of world history, but it's a huge part of Jamaican history. Just to talk to everybody and get it on record, get them on film, talking about Bob and kind of those times. So that's that's what I did. I interviewed about 90 people, and about 50 or 60 of them are in the film. But um, now all those people are on record. They, they, it exists, and uh, I think that that's part of what's important about this film. It's, 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 it's history. <laughs> well, you know, it's hard. You know, there's 50 songs of Bob's in this movie. And still people come up to me and say, well, you left out my favorite song. What do you think? So there's a lot of good songs out there. Um, I think that my favorite, for reasons which will become apparent when people have seen the movie, the song that means the most to me is Cornerstone, which is a very little known song that Bob wrote in 1969. And it's very autobiographical. And I think um, because of that importance to his life, um, I think as people who say, they will understand why it's my favorite. All right, so I would say enjoy the movie when you can already see it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Red carpet, which is red, green, and a bit purple, and it's wide. There's a lot of different, it's, it's incredible. Look at this view, it's absolutely beautiful. So it's definitely a better place. I'm, I'm excited, but I'm also a bit nervous because I'm a bit worried about what are people going to think. Uh, yeah, no, I'm gonna enjoy it. I hope I'm gonna enjoy it. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna stay and watch the whole thing. I think I'm gonna watch the first half hour, see what people think, and then come back for the end. Watch Scorsese, obviously one of the greats of all time, was going to make this film, but he didn't have time. And Jonathan Demme, best known for making Sounds of the Lambs, he was going to do it. Um, and he got some way towards doing it, but I think he went down a path which he and the producers didn't, didn't, didn't agree on. It was a path not really about Bob, it was more about the feel of Jamaica and um, uh, capturing the Jamaican vibe. And I think that, that um, 
uh, they, they parted company. Creative differences, they call it in Hollywood, don't they? Um, so, yeah, I was the third one coming on. And in a way, that's a bit intimidating, but also, I think you imagine that everybody had spent so long wanting this film to be made that when I came on, they just left me alone because they were so keen to get it done. So there was an advantage to me as well. So what do you think the, 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 the